Can you give me your thoughts on the receiving core this year? Well, I tell you, our guys have made a lot of progress, uh, obviously uh, understanding the system, being the second year in it, and been really proud of their progress of not knowing only uh, what to do but how to do it. Uh, you know, obviously a little blow losing Leon last week. Uh, feel feel bad for him. He worked really hard and was somewhat of a leader of that group. But, you know, anytime you have an injury, always somebody steps up. So now, you know, a Michael Carr, a Chris Smith, a uh, Arcedo Clark, all those guys on the outside have got to really step in and, and, and uh, you know, and pick it up a little bit. Um, overall, though, they've worked hard. We've got to still improve in a lot of areas. But uh, we're getting better, but we're still, we're still very young. Can you give your thoughts on Chad Bumpus and Brandon Heavens, how good they've been to this receiving core? Well, you know, the way our, our offense is set up right now, the H's are getting a little more action based on our play action, the way we're throwing the ball so much, you know, and on first down. Our play action really uh, sets up for the inside guys to probably get a few more looks than the outside guys. But they're, they're making some plays, they're catching the ball, and, uh, you know, they still need to improve in perimeter blocking a little bit, but they, they're getting better. Uh, but they're working awfully hard, and I think they're a pretty good little one-two tandem. What are you looking for at Florida this weekend? You know, this weekend in Florida, we're going to have to catch some football, make some plays, uh, our, especially our H's. When we get our hands on the ball, we're going to have to make some plays against man coverage because they're going to play man coverage just about the entire game. And on the outside, when our numbers are called, we're going to have to make some plays uh, and, and be physical with them because, we, you know, Chris Smith and some of our guys are big, strong guys, and, and they've got to use their body to be physical when they need to. And we've got to block extremely well on the perimeter and open up some, some bigger runs for big ballot. And so, you know, I always say, you know, it always starts at line of scrimmage for those runs, but the receivers turn the runs into bigger plays. And so we need to do a great job of turning those those uh, medium, medium runs into some big runs, and hopefully we can do our part.